Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's Nick from Noob Kill coming at you with another man video today. So, guys, of course, preseason and our season one field pass has come to an end. Um, our new season is here for season two, and we are collecting our little milestone rewards that did not all fully collect, such as my iconic pack select and my mana cash and all that stuff. Now, of course, coming along with the new season, that means we are in season two. All of the training points do not really carry over anything. So it does say that this is season one. I'm very interested to see if that will transfer. I wanted to take Take a little test here i don't think it's gonna be um all your season team training is gonna go back and reset now guys um back to level zero and unless you mastered it and got that like five percent mastery bonus but um but yeah man let's go ahead and claim all this stuff so there we go um so team season training they're actually just talking about this so season two back to the gridiron season team training achievements have been temporarily removed we are replacing the achievements in the near future all current and future training will count towards new achievements and you'll be immediately rewarded when they go live again so seems like there's a little bug with the season team training transfer um honestly i'd rather just have it not have a boost but it's a way for us to keep on engaging and everything like that i wish this boost just like stayed on forever man like last year i feel like this is a little better because it's for the whole like month instead of like every single week you need a boost but i don't know that's what we got right here now here are our players guys back to the gridiron man looking really nice we got Lattimore and george kittle are gonna be um the marvels right here oh, no sorry that's not is it kittle yeah it is kittle there's kittle kittle's in that picture right there um but yeah man they're nice 139 overall that is pretty fire back to the gridiron i like the little neon um a type of colorway that we do got right here very very nice um but yeah man let's check it out let's check it out so earn field bash points through the back to the grid iron specific goals and daily goals to progress through the milestones so pretty much the same thing hasn't changed for the past two seasons guys for fuel passes um and then of course guys complete challenges on the back to the grid iron for first time rewards so the, of course you guys know the whole gates and everything there trade players released during back to the grid iron for exclusive 139 overall marvel marshawn Lattimore. and you guys can see the george kittle he does have this team season training so you guys know with like the um with the cd lamb um he is gonna be your reward player for doing your team season training right there so there we go um of course we got other players such as tj watt jamar chase got a card right there um buddha baker and tyler smith are our other mythics in the game now rank up your team with season team training claim um the epic iconic and that of course like we did mention is george kittle now in today's video we are going to be purchasing the vip pass and like i say in every single um i guess a vip or purchasing of the field pass i do think it is worth it it's probably the best bang for the buck inside the game because you of course you get your Madden cash you get the vip section unlocked that gets you your tj watt um and all that goodness and all the other currencies so yes it is worth it but at the end of the day you guys choose that if you guys want to spend your hard-earned money you guys earned your money so yeah man if this does bring you enjoyment Madden mobile and and, and you want to play the game and you want to make it splash a little bit i do think this is way better than just straight up buying Madden cash so um this is the field pass but again i am buying this because one i am a content creator so i make videos on this um and all that stuff and again i do think it is worth it but let's go ahead and jump into everything so let's let's jump into it so the winner is okay so we got our little tokens um i picked some games right i picked some games wrong so here's our iconic select of course if you guys do do the field pass you kind of hold off until the end you kind of upgrade your team accordingly um so first off i want to get a nice i need to get some i need to get some secondary help man you guys you guys can definitely see the safeties um and all that stuff so it looks like they did not update it so we got like the program players in the game so that is something but you know what you guys can see my team um we got jamie ward and i think i'm gonna actually go for xavier mckinney who did get a great pick of jalen hurts this week in week one but honestly for myself when i am going against other people and on their defense this man is showing up all the time um blocking my passes and all that stuff so i definitely want him on my team and then of course my other select i think i'm gonna go and pick up an o-line player i know that might sound a little crazy but get some good run game get some of that in there um and that's what we're gonna do so i think out of the out of everything here i could have went for a special team and just kind of got like the positions done with but knowing my luck when we do the like random iconic sets for of course any type of program we're probably gonna pull a punter or something but looking at my o-line it looks like the tackle is our weakest position so i guess we're gonna pick up a tackle right here so let's get the big tristan work i think that's a good pickup right there that's a good pickup for me so let's take that and i also get a plus pack right there yes sir all right so um i got every game that i think we picked right besides um actually wait no the rams they did not win 
the Rams did not win, and the Chiefs, I picked, um, uh, what's it called? I did not pick the Chiefs right. I picked Baltimore on that one. So we hit them. We hit them on that one. 200. So 200 is on the hits. Um, I guess, uh, I think it's 150 is on the loss, the miss. So let's see. This is the miss. This huh? is the Rams. We still got 200. <laughs> we still got two. What? I, I don't know what to say there. I got 200 every, regardless, hit or miss. Okay, interesting. Um, a chance that an epic player will take the note for that right now. All right, so let's go and purchase the field pass and everything like this. I just got off from work, so we are claiming this. I wanted to claim everything on camera and everything like that. We have a lot of st program stamina for kickoff now, though. But if we go to the VIP pass, I want to check out one thing before we get into this. Now, of course, guys, like I said, we are going to purchase the field pass, but I want to try something a little different, and I want to direct your guys' attention to the actual Madden Mobile web store. If you guys don't know anything about it, you guys want to make sure you learn about it about it and, and learning about it is right here so number one you want to make sure you guys you know madden mobile is owned by ea and made by ea so you want to have an ea account and then you want to link that ea account to your madden mobile account and then basically go to madden mobile web store so they have this little web store right here where you can actually purchase everything from the game um on this little web store you're gonna purchase it it's gonna pop up on um madden mobile why am i why, what's the benefit from this of course since this is directly dealing with ea they're gonna be getting all all that goodness so what they do instead of going through apple and apple taking their cut they kind of give you give your whole they just get the whole revenue share i guess basically but what they kind of do entail they give you some extras and one of the extras for the field pass it looks like if you were to buy it um right here um you do get an extra 150 mana cash so if you're already gonna buy it why not go ahead and do it on the web store you do get an extra 150 mana cash but one other thing i do want to mention on the web store is why i want you guys to log in you guys see i have 19 items i've been just kind of saving this every single day guys you guys can come to the web store and you guys can claim 40 free manning cash and that can be 40 all the way up to 1000 every single day at 10 30 a.m eastern time this will refresh and all you got to do is link your ea account go to the web store and claim now and boom I am all set and I will now have the Madden cash in my account. So that is awesome. But let's go and purchase the field pass that we are mentioning. So give me one second. There we go. It says our order is all complete. So we can go ahead and close that. We bought the VIP section. And now if I go to Madden Mobile, let's go and jump back into it. Now when I go ahead and jump back into it, one of these guys is going to be my VIP section. So um, let's go and claim that. So here it is. There it is. So it's going to come up in the inbox. So there's the web store purchase. So now I do get that extra 150 mana cash we got the bonus we got the vip section unlocked so that is how you do it again it, it, it's not really something necessary that you need to go to the web store you just want to get a bonus if you guys are already buying it why not get some more free mana cash out of it right um of course it does help out ea a little more like i said it's go pretty much just going straight to ea instead of apple taking their cut and that's why they give you that little bonus and everything like that but um yeah man we did go out unlock the vip section and uh, now let's check it all out so of course course you guys know um the vip section is pretty much the same thing top is uh the vip bottom is the free player free to play player so moving on to this so it looks like we got our course our playbook um another big thing that of course inside of buying the vip section which again adds to like a little bit more of the benefit is the madden base guys you will not be able to play these madden base um i guess last ones that give you the biggest payout unless you buy the field pass which to me that kind of sucks that actually sucks a lot i don't know why they did it like that but that's something to mention right there but um yeah let's go back to the field pass and check it all out so um you guys can see now we have season two training points that's why it's number two and everything like that so um looks like our first big big um a reward is of course still epics are pretty good in the game so twelve thousand. if you guys are a vip member um yeah at about thirteen thousand uh points you will get yourself um two uh, epic select players um moving on to to our next one looks like our first iconic for a free to play player i mean um for um a vip player is gonna be at twenty one thousand. it looks like uh, at 11 uh, 21 000, you do get a free jj watt i mean tj watt sorry um so that's pretty great um and then of course if we keep on scrolling to twenty seven thousand, is where you get the actual iconic if you were a vip member and if you were not you still get an iconic select which is very very nice which i wish it did an include since it just got released right wish they included like the kickoff or what was the program first snap 
players and all that stuff but we will see if when those change and everything like that but um yeah man there it all is of course you do get a lot of man and cash if you are a vip section 2000 right there so in total you do get a lot of man and cash throughout the program um if you are knocking out your daily objectives logging in every single day you should be able to hit the twenty-seven thousand if you were a vip member um if you bought the vip uh, and all that stuff but checking out the journey so i wanted to go and look at this real quick because jamar chase obviously is a great card um and i'm actually a little happy that they did not raise the the, the gate too much i think to get sauce was about three thousand five hundred and thirty five so i might be wrong on that one but i remember it being three thousand something um 3000 i think it was 3500 3400 so um to me on our first season that gate was very very high and i mentioned that at the end of that little video that i did make of upgrading my team about like yo this is the first one in the game you want people to have a good experience of unlocking these these cards hey i bought the field pass it's 40 dollars um for me in in canada right that's the price of a gym membership i'm i'm paying and i'm interacting with the game every single day and I still was not even close. I finished the season off at 3,100, and I wasn't close to getting the first gate to get one Sauce Gardener, man. So that was a little bit of a sucky experience because, again, I did pay for the field pass. It wasn't like I did not purchase something, and then for that to help me hopefully hit the gate and it didn't hit kind of sucked but it's kind of nice that they didn't raise i believe they didn't raise the gate too much from last season because i believe it was like 3500 so that is really good i think i should be able to hit this gate this time if i interact with all of the kickoff stuff get an iconic whatever they drop for the next couple programs before the month ends um, of september i possibly should be able to get this gate with the team season training and all that stuff so yeah man that is that what we got of course if you do want to get like the 10,000 mana cash you're dropping a lot more money but you do have that mana cash it's 4352 so that's kind of what we got you guys tell me what your thoughts about the player pool they kind of selected marshawn Lattimore is very very nice and everything like that and you guys can see there is the kittle trade in and everything so just checking out the stats on this kiddo i'm gonna check it out um so flipping this guy around 139 overall 141 quickness 141 speed and acceleration and then of course his receiving stats are right there um 143 overall in receiving so yeah man and that is gonna be back to the gridiron second um i guess past our first season with of course actual nfl kickoff going on i hope you guys enjoyed sunday football i had a blast watching all the games again it was so great but yeah man thank you guys so much for watching if you guys did enjoy this video go ahead and smash that like button guys hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you know we post out any other madden mobile videos but thank you guys so much for watching always stay hype and i'll catch you guys soon peace What's up?